Do I sometimes think that I'm worth more because of the amount of likes on Twitter, on Instagram, on TikTok? Um, you know, we post a picture, we post a video, and we check how many people will like this. And we sometimes think that this gives us a sense of self-worth. And in our gospel today, uh, three times, Jesus tells us, Do not be afraid. Your life is worth more than sparrows. And for me, that's a comforting uh, statement from Jesus. But also there's a bit of a challenge at the end, you know, when he says, you know, um, when you witness my name before other people, I will also do so before the Father. But if you don't, then, you know, I might not uh, recognize you in front of the Father. And sometimes, you know, we are afraid to, to, to say that we are Christians or proclaim Christ as our Lord and Master, especially on social media platforms. And uh, how do we sort of, uh, you know, balance this in our lives, that we shouldn't be afraid to say who we are. And people won't like what we say, uh, especially as Christians, um, telling the truth. Um, professing the values of Jesus, what he taught us. And sometimes, you know, uh, this will be unpopular for some people. And this is exactly what it means to be a Christian, you know. Uh, we are not there to be liked by everybody, but we are there because Christ says, you know, love me and follow me, uh, despite all the criticism that you will receive uh, in life and from other people. And so let these words comfort us and also at the same time challenge us, you know, how do I live my life as a Christian today? Not just as a Sunday Christian, but every day, in every sphere of life. That, uh, you know, whether in school, work, wherever we find ourselves, that we do manifest the name of Jesus to people out there. And uh, we live to the values that Jesus has taught us. And that we go through this life, through this new week, fearless in the fact that Jesus is there with us, walking with us, beside us. We might not see him, but is there to guide us and to walk with us and telling us all the time, do not be afraid. May well, you have a wonderful Sunday and a blessed week ahead.